YouTube, this is Lady Cha-Cha, and today, like every other day, I just come here to show you what I do since I'm unemployed. My job that I do while I'm at home is looking for a job, and I will tell you that looking for a job is truly a job. I have filled out so many applications I can't even name. I can't even count, rather. It is becoming a little disheartening trying to find a job. Um, I was telling my husband in Fayetteville, it seems like you need to be established uh, to find something other than working at a McDonald's. I've applied at Lowe's about, I don't know, three, four times. Cashier, front end, uh, specialist, decline, decline, decline. I have applied at Home Depot, cashier decline. And I'm like, geez, what do you have to have a, a bachelor's degree to, to work the cash register? I've done that before. But I don't know whether it's my age or what it is, but I'm not incompetent. I can work. So it has been, it's been pretty hard trying to find a job here. Um, my husband, he uh, was unemployed as well. well he was retired but um and he just so happened to walk into a business that he had worked before and they offered him a job <laughs> I'm like dang you just walk in a place and you get a job I have applied and applied and applied and to no avail I have yet to be called for even an interview Everything's just declined or I haven't heard from them. It's, it is really disheartening, but I keep the faith. It's just, um, you know, I have to look at it as, well, it's not the right job for you, Charo. When, whatever job you get, it's going to be the right job for you. Don't accept anything, just any old thing because you want to work and you know I know I want to work but I want to be happy with what I'm doing so if I'm not being happy then I know that I won't last with the job so um, God has everything in control and I was listening to um, Sandy from Sister Cousins and she lost her job and here I am looking for a job but um Sandy's gonna be okay and Sandy is uh she has strong faith and she's gonna be all right just as I will I I will be fine uh, it's just that um after I have been home now for um, almost two years without working now. So, you know, it's nice being at home, but I feel like I need to do something and, uh, and exercise my mind um, and, and just be able to walk around and, and, and exercise, period, my body. Um, trying to exercise here <sighs> I try and I do it for a few days and oh my god I just don't stick with it especially with it being with it being so hot and then right now the air conditioning in in our home um, is not working as well as it should be but um that's going to be fine as well, you know. So, if I could get some advice on 
I don't know, I guess like maybe I'm not doing my resumes well. I don't I don't know. I try to critique it to the job itself. But, you know, it's it's just crazy. So if you all have any advice for me, um I don't know. If it's somebody out there in Fayetteville that can tell me something to do, <laughs> I would greatly appreciate it. Um, this is just a random chit chat video and I'll let you see what I'm looking at right now. So this is what I, I do all day is check the the computer I'm on indeed um, I have I didn't think that I would want to go back into um, being a hairstylist but that's what I have my greatest uh, experience with so uh, that may be what I will start back doing is um, hair Maybe start out part time, and um, yeah, this is what I've been doing. I actually filled out a place, uh, filled out an application for a salon uh, yesterday, and um, the second step is to go check out the well, come into the salon and talk to the manager. So. I am going to do that today and see what happens. So y'all wish me luck. Um, I hope it'd be something that I, I would like, you know, to do in somewhere that I wouldn't mind working. Um, I know I'm asking a lot, but when you get a certain age, you don't want to deal with a lot of foolishness and in a salon, there can be, in any job, I ain't gonna just say a salon, but it could be a lot of foolishness in any type of work that you deal with. Um, some of the people can just be so petty, and I hope it's not like that. Well, thank you all for just sitting there and listen to, listening to me rant, chit chat about my daily life. <laughs> Peace and blessings, and please don't forget to subscribe to Lady Cha Cha. Give me a big thumbs up and give me a comment. Blessed. I'm out. <laughs>